Hi, my pretties, welcome back. So tonight we are stopping at Ikea. And let me just say this off the top because I know somebody is like, whoa, her window is so dirty. <laughs> It is. It is. I have to go to the car wash. I was driving and I mean, bugs was just hitting that window. But anyways, we're going to continue. Um, so I'm in an area that I've never really been to. I was on a long trip somewhere and I'm headed home and I said, let me stop at this Ikea because I haven't been to one in a long time. So I popped over here, which this is my first time in this location and it was really, really nice. However, you guys, it closes at did it close it closed at nine and here i am walking in and it is literally eight o'clock so if you cannot already do the math it closes in an hour and you guys know look at that the showroom is upstairs and then the market hall is downstairs ikea is gigantic so i'm going to power walk through here i couldn't decide if i wanted to go upstairs to the showroom we but i said no Let's just start down here. This is the little child care center. Of course, there's no kids in there because it's 8 o'clock at night. So we're just going to power walk through Ikea. It's not going to be a long video at all. Um, I really just was in the area and wanted to see what they had. So these plates, you get a pack of six for $2.99. Um, they also have the cups to match. $2.99 Ikea is amazing for all kinds of little things like this. That's the little tray for $4.99 that goes behind your, your faucet or underneath your faucet. You see that, that picture? So I thought that was pretty cool. That little thing right there, you can get all the little soap dispensers and stuff to go with it. Uh, $2.99 right there. I thought that was pretty cool. You have this glass measuring cup. And then over here, these real pretty uh, red bowls caught my attention for $7.99. They were pretty big. You have the little compartment at the top. Um, yeah, and then everything just kind of looked like Christmas colors to me. And then here was some pasta that was shaped like little moose heads. Look at that. I thought that was so cute. <laughs> Ikea always has the cutest stuff. So, um, like I said, we're just going to kind of roam around and look. I was going super fast, trying to hit everywhere. I wasn't able to, but I'm going to see as much as I can. Uh, these plates were new. I thought they were pretty nice. You had those up there at the top. Uh, this little water pitcher or carafe or whatever you want to use it for. Uh, they had some placemats right here. The little napkin holder, I like that. I don't know if I just liked it because it was gold. I think I like the shape, but it was $12. They had a lot of throws. Oh, this one is like nice and chunky. Uh, I do apologize. There is going to be a lot of stuff that I didn't even look at or tell you guys the price because um, I was in such a rush. This one was nice. I really like that one, $21.99, but it was nice and thick. And I'm kind of torn like, dang, I should have picked that up, but I didn't. And then I also like this one right here with the little dots all over it. And that one was $26, I think that's it. But I thought it was cute. And this one was kind of cool too. That would be cute in the kid's room. It kind of felt like, like felt, um, but it had the little scallop in, you know, detail on the end. You got the cute little cat plate. Uh ikea is good for their duvets um this one was 99 it said it was new so it's like a new little fall print i believe and yeah so sometimes i'm just gonna pop in and out not do a whole lot of talking we're just gonna kind of walk around and look uh i loved all the little colorful pillows and stuff look at that one it's shaped like a triangle or a yeah i guess this is a triangle I was going to say a pyramid. They always have lots of pillows. Look at these. They were so colorful and so cool. Uh, I was wondering if my daughter would like those in her room, but I don't know. 
And then my eyes spotted the cute little ghost throw blankets. Oh my goodness, you guys, how cute. And it's reversible. So you have the white with the gray ghost, or you can look, you know, on the inside, it's gray with the white ghost. Uh, super cute, super, super cute. Uh, they also had this little fuzzy or furry throw blanket and some really cute robes. I actually looked at these on their website after I was uh, done filming and I went home or I came home. I did look at that. Uh, I actually like that. I like the colors on that one. This one was cute too. It kind of looked like the print that was on that plate over there that said new. So like some lettuce leaves or something, some kale. <laughs> uh, you got the black cat pillow, which was cute. And yes, you guys, the, the, the Ikea has some Christmas stuff out. The doormat, $15 with the gnomes. That's not the only Christmas items that I spotted. We will see a little bit more. You have these doormats for, was that $5.99? I thought it was kind of cute. I like the green and the black. This one has like little ladybugs all over it. There's a cute little cat with the heart. Come as guests and leave as friends. And there's even a little tennis shoe doormat. You see that? Now, they did have a few Halloween items out, um, like you saw the, the throw blanket. Um, when I hit this corner right here, we're gonna see a doormat, which I like. I also like that one too, the welcome with the succulents. And then there's the boo. I actually purchased that. Here's some uh, little lantern, not even lanterns. They're just some glass pumpkins for $13.99. I thought those were really pretty. And that glass vase made me think of a cauldron. I don't know why, but it did. <laughs> you have some mats for the chair, some little containers and all these different colors. And look at these vase, so pretty. I love the three colors. I was like, do I need one of these? They were $12.99. They are new. That blue is so pretty. But I feel like if I would have got them, I, need, I would have wanted the white, blue, and pink. This one is also pretty too. $19.99 with the gold on it. And then I spotted some of the Christmas stuff and I was like, oh yeah, we're not ready for this right now. But of course I had to go over there and take a look. There was some candles, some snow globes, some gnomes, and this tree. <laughs> This bowl right here for $30 is really cute. And the little succulent decor, you get it, all three of those. And never have I ever seen a copper color banana and an apple. So I had to look at that. Okay, so right here is where they had some of their uh, Halloween stuff displayed. You can see the little pumpkin lanterns on the table. You got that boo pillow up there, the black and white stripe. Love those purple lights hanging up there at the top. There's the doormat again that I purchased. So there wasn't a lot of Halloween stuff, but they did have a few, few items. I don't know if all the locations will start putting out more, but for now, that's all I saw. Um, Ikea has some really cool mirrors and they're really nicely um, priced. This one right here is really cool, that gold. And it was $159. I like the top. Something down there was $28. You see that yellow that yellow picture? Uh, here's some faux plants and some baskets. And these lights right here made me think of like transformers or something. See how they're all, you know, like they're coming apart and like it's gonna go up into a dome or something. Those are $80. I thought they was pretty cool. And you can get different colors. I wish I would have had more time in here to walk around, but unfortunately, like I said, I was on my way home. I was still like an hour and a half away from home. So did I need to stop in Ikea? Absolutely not, but I did. And we just made a quick trip. I like that little pumpkin light. The butterflies. It's all the cute little lights for the kids' rooms. Uh, this area over here, everything had these little horses on it. You see that horse picture right there? Everything over there had that little detail on it. I don't know what that's about, but it was horses on everything. The pillows and everything. So as you can see, I'm just roaming around. Ain't that crazy? Ikea with nobody else in there. There was actually people walking around. You just can't see them because everybody was kind of making their way downstairs to leave 
which is what I'm actually doing as well. But I, I just had to look around. Um, I love how they have stuff set up to give you an idea on how you might want to decorate or, you know, things you might want to, you know, put how you want to put it in your place. That little couch was pretty cool. I like that one. Uh, what was that? 1149. Mm -hmm. And this is the area with all the chairs and stools and the couches and stuff. So, like I said, I'm making my trying to make my way out of here already. I like that yellow couch. This area, this little living room, I love that. I love that. I thought that looked so cozy and so comfortable. More couches and more chairs. Look, there's some red ones back there. Um, over here, just some more display rooms. It's probably best that I had to have a, a time limit in here, like an hour. Because usually when I go in Ikea, I'm in there for like three, four hours. And um, yeah, so if you're wondering what I had in my basket, I picked up that doormat that said boo. And I did pick up the one of the ghost um, throw blankets. I did, I did, I had to get one. So just some little tables and stuff. And hopefully any of you that has never maybe been to an, an Ikea, maybe this will kind of give you an idea of what you can find in there. Uh, like I said again, excuse me, ex so sorry that it's so fast, but it is. I like that cabinet for $5.58. See, there's some people. <laughs> I wasn't by myself. Um, you guys know what I always say too, when I'm in a big space like that, I wish I could wear some skates. I would have skate all through Ikea. They would have been like chasing me down. Like, lady, you gotta get up out of here. But ooh, it would have been so fun to skate in there. I like that kitchen. <laughs> I'm all off. Talking about skating. I love that kitchen as well. I was looking at those chairs, the bar stools. Not my favorite. I don't like chairs that don't have any support for your back, but they look nice in that kitchen. Love how the island has all those drawers and cabinets right there. That's something I would consider. Um, yeah, I don't know. I was thinking about that. This cute little kitchen right here. And in this kitchen, I love the wall of cabinets. And I was looking, I'm like, wait a minute, that says there's a fridge in there. So you do have a little fridge. And so I opened it and voila, you have the fridge, which was crazy though, because the door opens and you have the cabinets up at the top. So, I mean, hey. And then there's the freezer down at the bottom. I will say it was a little small. Um, I'm sure you can get it, uh, you know, to fit what you want maybe, but the idea of it was really cool. I love the, how the cabinets in that room right there and the cat, everything was black. I like that. And then I like this kitchen as well. Here's some cookies. They would be really cool to like decorate. They were just some like scalloped um, little cookies or whatever. Look at that bed. <laughs> they letting you know that you can lift that bed up and put your storage underneath, I think. I think that's what it was trying to show us. So just passing through all the mattresses and the beds and stuff over here. And this room right here, I think what caught my attention in there is that scalloped wall behind the bed. I was like, oh, I wonder if my daughter would like that. I really like that. Some little panda dolls and some lanterns. And we are almost out of here, you guys. And I tell you, it was gonna be quick. Next time I'm able to go, I'll make sure I go in the daytime and that way we can spend some more time. So I'm down here at the bottom, getting ready to make my way to these registers. Look at that warehouse, whoo. I used to work in a warehouse a long time ago and I was driving a forklift. I would have been racing all up and down them aisles, man. I tell you, <laughs> that's what I thought about when I looked down them, them rows right there. Um, but I thank you guys for coming with me. Um, sorry it was quick. I said that like three times already, but you guys already know. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye.